Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today I am here with my second Ava's Country Cupboard Haul. I have a lot of stuff to go through, so I'm just going to get into it and start with the samples. The first one is Good Morning Sunshine, and this is Lemon, Grapefruit, and Oranges. I received nine samples, but I gave two away because I didn't really care for these scents. But... This one is very, very refreshing. I do get that very tart note in this scent, but it's all right. Not one of my favorites. I'm not going to spend too long on these samples because I just have so much to go through. So the next one I got is Elephant Ear, and I got this in a four pack, so I'm just going to um, smell it when I get to that point. The next one is... Blue Raspberry Fizz, and I received this in my first order. Very, to me, I get more of like a lemon fizzy, not so much uh, raspberry. The next one is Pumpkin Pecan Milkshake. This one is so good. I'm not a huge fan of like pumpkin pecan waffles from Bass and Body Works, but I love that that milkshake note is in there so it's not like overpowering on that waffle scent it's a very creamy pumpkin pecan waffles it's very nice I can handle this one I really enjoy it and the next samples we have is blueberry lemon cake I got this in a clamshell so I'm just gonna tell you what I think when I get there the next one is molasses cookies and this is this is nice I do get that molasses kind of like spicy sweet note it's very it's a very good bakery scent and the last sample we have is dreamy lavender not a huge fan of this one I don't tend to really uh, go for sweet lavenders and this is definitely a sweet lavender i like more of um the herbal lavenders but i'll try this one out okay we're gonna get into the haul so this the first thing i got was three ring circus i got two packs of them and the scent notes are sweet bakery funnel cake with notes of cotton candy and citrus fruits yeah this one is a very good and i didn't show you it's two-toned this is a very good sweet bakery scent i definitely pick up on that funnel cake in that lemony citrus note it's a very good blend very yummy The next one we have is a two-pack of these little bunts in the scent Amazon Mist. And this is fresh dew, green grass, exotic flowers, herbs with a hint of raindrops. Sorry for the crinkling bags. Ugh, this one is so, so refreshing. Um, that... It's just so good. I definitely get that green grass note, but also it's very floral. It's a good blend, very fresh, like like you stepped out on a nice spring day, and it's just very good. The next one we have is, I'm just going to do a clamshell. And this is black and blue, strong blend of ripe summer berries. I love that deep blue color. And I like how it's marbled on the top a little bit. You could see it more in person. But, yeah, this is good. This is a very sweet mixed berry type scent not much to say about it just a very sweet mixed berry the next thing we have is a scent shot 
sorry guys, I'm just grabbing um, in blue steel, and this is blue sugar and beach, and beachy clean musk, and I believe this is like a two-tone, yeah, blue and gray. Ugh, I love this one. Um, I love blue sugar, and her blue sugar is really good. I don't get a whole lot of that beachy note, mainly just a very uh, sweet, kind of masculine blue sugar. I love this. I, I would buy a lot of this scent. Very good. Okay, the next thing we have is another two-pack of little bunts in blue summer sky and I don't know if this is a dupe for Yankee Candle I know they have a blue summer sky um, scent I'm not sure this is fresh berries lush florals ginger cedar vanilla musk and amber oh this is different um it's kind of on the the floral, but it's also kind of on the masculine side. Um, I do pick up that amber. Maybe that's where I'm in the cedar. Maybe that's where I'm kind of getting that masculine note, but it's very, it's very refreshing as well. Okay, the next thing we have is a clamshell of blueberry lemon cake and this I also got as a sample as you've seen very pretty blue on the top now with this one I don't get a whole lot of blueberry same as the sample obviously I paint I mainly get the lemon cake but this is on the borderline of a cleaner lemon which I'm not a huge fan of um I, I tend to get a lot of like cleaner lemons when it's supposed to be like a sweet lemon I pick up on that cleaner note um but you might be different but I'm gonna try give this a try see what it smells like when warmed um and then I'll know more about the scent Okay, the next thing we have is a bunt pack of Coffee House Treats, and this is Baked Goods and Coffee. Yeah, this is, this is kind of like a nutty coffee, kind of like a hazelnut coffee. I do get the sweetness from the baked goods, but mainly just a very sweet, nutty coffee blend. I really like it. And I'm not a huge fan of coffee blends, so that's that's saying something. Oh, sorry. I didn't know if you wanted you guys wanted to know the scent description for blueberry lemon cake. It's kind of self-explanatory. Fresh blueberries, sweet lemon, freshly baked cake drizzled with buttery lemon and mandarin zest sorry that was the scent description for this one okay the next one is a four pack of elephant ear and i did get a sample of this one and this is fried dough and cinnamon sugar oh this one is good yeah i get that fried note but I get the sweet uh, cinnamon sugar scent. Very strong. Super good. I'm excited to melt this. I'll probably wait till kind of like colder days to melt this or maybe just um, wait to melt it until fall because it's a very fall bakery type scent. Okay, the next one we have is a clamshell in the scent poolside and this is fresh fruity cocktail by the pool oh, this one is very good it's definitely um 
an aquatic, <clears throat> excuse me, my voice is aquatic scent, but I do get that, um, the fruity, the fruity note in that. It's very pretty. I'm excited to mount this definitely in like a hot summer day. The next one we have is Clamshell of Salty Sea Air, and I actually have two clamshells of this. I love this scent. The scent note is crisp ozone, salty sea spray, seaweed, sun-weathered driftwood, and a hint of water lily. Yeah, and this is just your classic um, fresh, salty ozone scent. I love it. Very, just very clean and crisp. <clears throat> the next thing we have is another scent shot in Teeny's Bakery. And this is baked pastry, glazed buttercream, vanilla ice cream, crushed almonds, and hints of cookie dough. And I believe this one is two-tone as well. Yep. This is just a very um, creamy vanilla bakery type scent. Not a whole lot to say about this. The next one we have is another um, bunt in Seaside, and this is Ocean Air and Summer Melon. Ugh, yeah. This is also another very oceany, crisp, clean scent. I do, I don't know if I really pick up a whole lot of melon. I just get a very refreshing, clean, aquatic scent. Really good for the bathroom. Okay, the next thing we have is another clamshell of tropical cotton candy. This is strawberries, raspberry, guava, green apple, and cotton candy. And the back is a very bright yellow. And the top. Ugh, this one smells like sweet tarts or some some type of candy. I've smelled this scent before. It's very familiar. I can't put my finger on it, but it's kind of it's kind of like sweet tarts or I don't know some type of candy. It's very very um very sweet, obviously, and very fruity. Um. And I think the rest of them are clamshells. So we have strawberry sugar cookie, and this is self explanatory. Now I'm I'm not a huge fan of this one. The strawberry in this is a very, very weird kind of rotten type strawberry scent. I don't care for it. I don't pick up a whole lot of sugar cookie. I'm hoping uh, I'm hoping it's better on warm than it is on cold. Just a very strange strawberry. And strawberry to me in wax is a very like hit or miss because sometimes it could smell very good and sometimes very bad. This is pink birthday cake which is Pink sugar and birthday cake. And then top. Yeah, this is just a good uh, sweet 50-50 blend of that uh, pink sugar and the sweet cake note. Pink sugar is a, is a feminine perfume. I'm not really sure the notes of pink sugar, but I know pink sugar is very popular. The next one we have is Marshmallow Glazed Donut. Yep, 
Yeah. Oh, God. That one's good. Very sweet fried donut type scent. Um, the marshmallow is probably obviously the sweetness, but it's a, like I said, it's a very sweet fried donut type scent. Sorry guys, I'm trying to go through these quickly because I have, I just have so much stuff. Next is wild berry cream cheese frosting. The back is super pretty purple. Uh, this is a very, <laughs> this is very good mixed berry, creamy, uh, sweet scent. It's exactly as it says. I get the cream cheese frosting and I get the mixed berries. Definitely a very strong one. Okay, the next one is Tropical Sweet Tea. And I don't have any, I don't have a scent description for the last few. I just couldn't find them. I don't really get a tea note with this one. I just pick up straight pineapple, a very sweet, kind of like pineapple mango type scent. Very refreshing, very juicy, crisp. This is a good one. Highly recommend that one for the summertime or springtime or whenever. <laughs> the next one is Fruity Pebble or I should say, I believe this is the last one, yep, is Fruity Pebble Cookie Dough. Bright yellow, and I know the top is super pretty, marbling. Ugh. Now I don't get the cookie dough. I pick up just that very, very strong Fruity Pebble note. It's very strong citrus scent. Definitely a good one. Alrighty guys, that was my big um, Ava's Country Cupboard order. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button. Let me know down in the comments below what you guys think and if you have tried any of these scents out. Alrighty, bye!